Hello everyone welcomes to my sister wives today today channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Three weeks after her brother Robert Garrison Brown passed away, Isabel Brown, star of Sister Wives, speaks out. Three weeks after her half-brother Robert Garrison Brown passed away, Sister Wives star Isabel Brown is paying tribute to him. On Tuesday, March 26, Isabel, 20, posted a beautiful vacation snapshot taken by her brother on her Instagram stories, accompanied by the words, I love you forever and I'll miss you always. The TLC personality incorporated Lord Huron's song Ends of the Earth in the background. The Nevada National Guard was present when the Brown family came together earlier this week for a memorial service in Garrison's honor. After completing basic training and joining the National Guard in 2015, Garrison went on to enroll in the College of Southern Nevada. The organization released some photos of the event, showing Janelle Brown sitting in the front row with her son Hunter Brown and Robin and Cody Brown a few seats down. In honor of him, a few of the vast family donned Hawaiian shirts, a nod to Garrison's 2019 launch of Bob's Floral, his little company. In addition, the 54-year-old Janelle was given a flag by the Nevada National Guard as a token of appreciation for her service. Brown, who was well known for his sense of adventure, took a great deal of travel and visited many different nations and continents. The National Guard said on Facebook on March 25 that he had a passion for comedy, amateur craftsmanship, and adventurous photography, with his night sky photography particularly moving those who viewed it. Brown demonstrated unwavering devotion to his country as a proud CAV scout and staff sergeant in the Army National Guard. In order to help others, he also had a compassionate spirit and decided to become a nurse. Garrison, who was 25 years old, was discovered dead from a self-inflicted gunshot wound on March 5 in his Flagstaff, Arizona, residence. When his younger brother Gabriel Brown found his body, he was pronounced dead at the scene. He had passed away the previous evening, it was found. Even though they are no longer together, Janelle and Cody, 55, acknowledged their son's passing in a shared post. Janelle, and I am very sorry to inform you of Robert Garrison Brown's passing. He was our beautiful boy. They were married from 1993 to 2022. He was a bright spot in the lives of all who knew him, the ex-couple stated in a shared Instagram post. Our loss will leave a void in our life that is so immense it will leave us speechless. Please respect our privacy and join us in paying tribute to his memory. According to a fan, Cody Brown just ran through a mall in Las Vegas. After his son Garrison Brown passed away tragically, Sister Wife star Cody Brown was reportedly spotted aimlessly browsing Caesars Palace stores in Las Vegas. He might have also hit the casino. Since his son's death, Cody has kept a low profile, yet life continues on. The fact that he was allegedly speeding through the Sin City complex raises alarms. Yes, he may have been racing to buy something or getting some exercise. Still, it's possible that he was acting strangely following the kind of tragedy that shatter a person. According to the ET video above, Cody had made some hurtful remarks about his former girlfriends and older children, of course, before Garrison passed away. Indeed, he addressed them as. The problem is, a lot of people believe Cody to be the jerk. He might be in shock right now, because he's been so blatant and disrespectful about his ex-wives, older children, and other things, and he and Garrison were strained when his son passed away. His words and deeds could come back to haunt him. He can become restless and start looking for methods to get away out of grief and maybe guilt. It makes sense if those emotions are affecting him. Cody and Robin have a reputation for hanging out in shopping centers, maybe this is just one of their favorite ways to decompress. Although it doesn't seem to align with their religious convictions, Caesar's Palace also offers that form of getaway. According to Hot and Ready on Reddit, the person in the above photo is Cody. Someone said he was speed walking around the shopping center. It's shocking that he would essentially gallop through a Nevada shopping center yesterday, especially when Cody is already the target of such harsh internet criticism. Some people rapidly walk through malls as a form of exercise. It's possible that he moved fast to avoid being cornered by admirers who may press harsh questions. 
Everybody handles loss differently, some choose to wail and hang their heads. He's most likely been crying a lot. Some people wish to start exercising in order to distract themselves from their discomfort. Grieving has no right way to do it. A person experiencing grief will experience mood fluctuations. Christine Brown finds that exercise helps her cope with her melancholy. Fans harassed Christine for sharing details of her life after Garrison's passing rather than simply his. Her will to survive does not, however, imply a lack of love for Garrison. He might, however, be in Las Vegas for another purpose, connected to his son Paydon Brown and ex-girlfriend Janelle Brown. Perhaps they're doing a sister-wife's movie? Janelle, Paydon, and Robin Brown, according to a different fan on the same Reddit thread, are also in Sin City. Cody is infamous for having conflicts with his own kids. There are more likely to be arguments when there are so many children. But the one with whom he appeared to struggle the most was with his older boys. Maybe Cody has an easier time interacting with females and women? However, he hasn't exactly been reconciling with Mary Brown, Janelle, or Christine. In addition, his daughter Gwendolyn Brown accused him of being an excessive spender, perhaps he was in shopping centers? There's been a lot of talk and no evidence, but it's obvious that Cody's preference for Robin caused a great deal of discord in the Brown household. Perhaps viewers believed that some of the drama was heightened solely to increase the entertainment value of the broadcast. Perhaps they were unaware of the true severity of the family's issues and how much Garrison was impacted. Although Cody is deeply embroiled in numerous conflicts, perhaps Garrison's untimely passing will allow him to make peace with his other kids. It's likely that Cody has been reflecting. He attended the funeral with Janelle and other people, it must have been a really upsetting event. I hope the family was able to enjoy all that made Garrison so special. He was extremely charming and sweet-natured. Before passing away, Garrison saved Ms. Buttons, a cat, from being put to death. He was a loving person toward animals. Garrison had issues that he was unable to resolve, yet he still loved his family. It has been suggested that Garrison drank, which may have contributed to his fragility. It is probable that he was an alcoholic who struggled to kick the habit. He may have been hurting himself since he was also having problems with an ex numerous factors were influencing the young guy and driving him towards suicide, yet many things remain unexplained. After learning of a worrying text that her son had sent to other individuals, Janelle reached out to him in an attempt to save her kid. After speaking with Garrison for some time, he stopped answering her. Then, worried sick, she asked a relative to see how he was doing. His body was discovered. This is awful, really depressing, and Cody should be allowed to go on walks in the mall or do anything else he needs to. Many parents argue with their children without having to go through this. In addition, Cody has to deal with the judgment of everyone around him at such a horrific loss. It will be up to the sister-wife star to decide how he will grieve during this difficult time.